up guys, my name is Soapsy and welcome back to another FIFA 21 video. Today we're going to be talking about the Hunt of our Foot Birthday objective, how to get this one done as easy as possible and a squad that you can use to maximise getting the objectives done as fast as you can. So first and foremost, let's look at them. You need to assist four goals for through balls using forwards. So that's going to be your strikers, your centre forwards, your right wings, your left wings. That's all going to count. Uh, the next one is to score two outs of the box goals, which should come naturally if you're finessing from the top of the box. But if not, you can try and get that with someone else if you message them potentially. Uh, score eight goals with Dutch players, which is relatively easy. You might be able to get that done early and then switch up your team. Um, and then win seven matches and score in 13 separate using Bundesliga players. So there's no specification for the team, but obviously if you're not using Bundesliga players and you're not using Dutch players, then you are going to miss out on getting those done easily. So with that in mind, let's have a look at the team that I have built. So on the screen, guys, is the team that I've built for the managerial masterpiece most. Obviously, we're working to that 77 rated squad. As you can see, it is a full Bundesliga side, uh, and there are some other options as to how you can hybrid this up and things like that. So going through it, we've got Nubel in goal, mainly because he's 75 rated, 6 foot 4, just fits the bill for this mode. And Babu is 79 rated, is one of the best Bundesliga players in this mode. He's really low rated and an absolute wall. You just can't get around him. A Kanji at centre back, that's 77 pace, 80 defending, wins it for me. Klosterman on the other side, 84 pace, 82 defending he's one of the best overpowered players for like 80 or below ratings gunter at left back 84 pace 82 physical 73 defending again really helpful for all of those fronts on the left hand side we've got dilrosen 84 pace 79 dribbling the reason he is there is mainly because he fits the bill as a, uh, a left mid dutch and bundesliga uh, we've got Boatus in, in Cam. He is obviously Dutch Bundesliga as well. Um, and then up top, we've got Rayner. If you held on to his 82 card, obviously I'm going to show you some other options if you didn't and you got rid of it in an SBC. And we've also got Rashika. Rashika mainly because he is four star, four star, high medium. I find him to be one of the most overpowered players in this mode. He has saved me a few times at Bundesliga. Uh, and I really, really rate that card. On the bench, you'll note that we do have Mitchell Van Bergen. We have also got Daniel Malen, Boadu, Kirk. Niakate is just there as a, another 75 rated placeholder uh, and then the two silvers to keep the rating down because we've obviously got Waman Gatuka in the team who is mental at that right hand side. So basically the uh, the idea with this team is obviously you need the Bundesliga goals and you can need the Dutch goals. So starting with mainly Bundesliga with two Dutch players in there, you can then bring on Van Bergen who you could bring him on up front or on the left wing, however you want to play him. Malen you can bring on up front, Bawadi you can bring on up front and basically just run with the, the Dutch players once you've got your Bundesliga goal and then try and get those Dutch goals done um, but effectively this team you're working with I think one spare rating so that's an option to upgrade slightly uh, He Chan is another option if you did not have yourself of course Reyna and then you can look at upgrading in other positions if you wanted to use a Leon Bailey at left mid and not bother with the Dutch left mid then that's perfectly fine as well uh, in terms of getting the uh, forward assists done just passing between your strikers is going to be a really easy method to do that but you could also convert your left and right mid to left wing and right wing so that any through ball by them will also count even though they're playing at left mid and right mid which won't make a difference obviously if you do opt for he chan then you've got some other options to upgrade with some spare ratings obviously five ratings to play with there so you can put in some of the Bundesliga players you might have in your club um, just another option, if you are someone that really, really likes having Pope in goal, you can go with Pope in goal, you can go with Tomori, who is obviously one of the most overpowered players for this mode, and Fredericks at right back. It will leave Wamangatuka on 7 chemistry, uh, but obviously with Hee-chan in the squad, makes up for the, uh, the other ratings, and then you can use that sweaty trio, and all of them should get at least 9 or 10 chem. Uh, whether they've got loyalty and obviously if you run a Bundesliga manager or an English Bundesliga manager depending on how you convert your managers then you can get full chem on everyone in this team obviously uh, Waman would go up potentially to 8 chem with a Bundesliga manager in there but the main thing with this setup is is that Reina is a great option, He Chan is a great option, Rashik is a great option. Uh, the rating is obviously brought down a little bit in the main team because of the fact that we've got Van Bergen on the bench here and also Malin on the bench here who aren't the normal 75s that you would keep the rating low with. Uh, the rest are happen to be coincidentally French or Bundesliga, uh, French Bundesliga or Dutch and happen to be 75 as well as placeholders and these two are just to keep the rating nice and low. Uh, if you are using Reina off the rip, the main reason I uh, suggest that is high medium, he's got 87 pace, 81 shooting four star four star so generally all of those things are great for this mode and you aren't going to get too many people who are going to go out of the way to ruin their team to put in a 90 rated player so generally that should help you get all the objectives done at the same time and then obviously if you get yourself a uh, Bundesliga goal you want to take off one of the strikers or you want to take off the winger and bring on your uh, your Dutch 
Mathieu over here in Malen, Van Bergen, Boadu and Kirk, any of those three to come on to get your Dutch goals done, then that is great. Obviously, once you've done the Dutch goals, you can just go full Bundesliga and make sure that you get those goals and your wins as well. If you like the video, guys, and it helps you out, please leave a like. If you want to subscribe to me, you can. Make sure to check me out on the socials in the about box below. My name's Soapsy, and I'll see you guys later.